Joel Goldberg with the new K-State basketball coach, Bruce Weber, who's here in the house wearing the purple and throwing out the first pitch today. First off, I, I got to know uh, what kind of baseball player w were you and, and how was that experience? Well, it's it's always scary to go to the mound. I've learned from the first time I did it, don't go on the mound. Stay on the grass and keep it nice and slow. I don't want to hit anybody or be dangerous, but I played baseball my whole life, was a catcher, long-time catcher, and uh, love coming out. It's great to be at the ballpark. What a, what a fantastic field. Yeah, don't bounce it. That's always the rule. And it doesn't matter where you throw it from. Just don't bounce it. Okay, well, new job. How's the transition going? You know, it's been great. The, the people have been very, very receptive. Uh, the K-State fans are unbelievable. Great passion. And had my uh, first experience with a football game Saturday. That was great to be around and the atmosphere there. And, and our players have been really receptive. To be, you know, it's uh, We have a good group, an experienced group, three seniors, and, and then a brand new practice facility uh, that will be opening up October 1st. And so, you know, you got to feel good about it, feel good about being in Manhattan. And you were recently in Brazil taking that group over there. Tell me how that trip went from a standpoint of basketball, but also just in, in getting to know who you have. Well, it was uh, when I was interviewing with John Curry, and, and John's been great, President Schultz has been great for me. But, he, you know, he said, uh, by the way, would you want to go to Brazil? And I said, well, you got a trip? And he goes, yes. He goes, you okay with it? I said, oh, it's perfect. You know, we got 10 days of practice. We've been around the kids. You got to see them in a different light. You know, we're in Rio de Janeiro, we're on the beaches. and. And, you know, just getting to know them, they get to know each other. And it, it's, it was a great experience and, and had, you know, learned a little bit about them basketball-wise. And then they created a good chemistry bond. I would see Johnny Giovatella catching the pop-up for the first out of the inning. Now, you go over to Brazil. I'm sure this isn't too intense of a thing. And you're evaluating and you're bonding. And something happened, Coach? <laughs> I got booted, uh, and, and I last year I don't think I got a technical, but you got to understand if you've ever gone on trips, uh, I, and I told the kids ahead of time, you got to expect the unexpected. You never know. One game we didn't have referees show up. Another one we have bad referees. You know, one game, two game, two officials, one, three. But uh, very, very physical, very good competition there. We were playing their pro teams. One of them was their national runner-up last year, had a couple guys on the Olympic team, and uh, the game got a little physical. We had, I think, five guys fouled out. We had intentional fouls, flagrant fouls, everything. And I was just trying to protect the kids, uh, you know, and make sure we did, we wanted to go home safe. That was the biggest thing. But And we did. And, you know, but it, it you know, they said, Coach, you got two T's, you got to leave the gym. <laughs> I said, I'll go upstairs. I, we came too far. If I, I got to watch the last quarter. Well, we're going to get a chance to, of course, see you uh, over in Manhattan, K-State, and throughout the Big 12 this year, but also you're here December 22nd at Sprint Center. I know at, at Illinois, a lot of games maybe up in Chicago or in St. Louis, but how about now being able to have that chance to play in the Sprint Center in Kansas City every year? Well, it's definitely something we want to continue to do, and you got Florida, Billy Donovan, the lead eight last year coming in, so a great game right before the holiday, so a Saturday night, we're, you know, we're hoping if we're playing well, we have a great, uh, you know, crowd there, so it's a great experience for our guys. All also, you got the Big 12 tournament there, so now you get that little bit of dress rehearsal in the Sprint Center, you know, which is a great venue, uh, you know, an NCA type venue that you you may experience down the road. So uh, we're we're excited about it. We hope to keep that game every year, keep a game in Kansas City if it's all possible. All right, Everett Tiford with the strikeout of Nelson Cruz, uh, Coach. Congratulations on the job. Best of luck with everything, and we look forward to seeing you around Kauffman Stadium, Kansas City, and in Manhattan for many years. I hope so. Thank you, Joe.